So I look a mess right now. So it is currently 7.28 a.m. Tuesday, September 14th. Um, hopefully y'all can see that. Um, today I have my Amazon interview, which if you watched enough Amazon interview videos, well, Amazon Q&A videos, then you know that Amazon doesn't officially interview you. Once you do all the paperwork and the application online, you already have the job. The, what they call an interview is really just you walking in, taking a drug test, filling out more paperwork, and then boom, you start work. Well, orientation, and then start working. So, yeah, I'm finna get ready for that. Y'all are finna see me do so. So, yeah. Bye. More anything you can between us, you look like my best friend. Y'all, so I'm here at Amazon and I'm mad AF. My appointment was from 9 o'clock to 9.30. It is 9.17 and I'm just now walking in. It's going to take me a good five minutes to get to the front of the building. Um, I was running a little behind because I had my appointment time mixed up. And then two, when I was on the highway, this big ass truck would not let me over at my exit. So I had missed my exit. And I had to go all the way up to the next exit, get, get off of it, then get back on it in the other direction. And then um, get off of the one I needed to be on to get here. And then I get here and it took me damn near 10 minutes to find a fucking park. Like, the place, place is big as fuck. And they got a whole lot of parking. But this shit is so packed. Like, there's so many fucking people here. So many fucking cars. It looks like a damn car lot or some shit. Like, this shit is buku big and buku full. I was tempted to take the spot that said reserves for pregnant women and stuff. But it said permit parking. I was really going to take it to. Like, I drove back around and everything. I'm in here. They got the designated arrows for which way you're supposed to drive. It say going this direction. I'm driving through it this direction. Like, this shit got me mad as fuck. Like, I feel like the universe trying to tell me, don't take this job. Then on top of that, I was trying to see if I could push the time back for my appointment. Because I was running late. Ooh, I'm starting to get out of breath. Damn. I'm just trying to see if I can push the time back for my appointment. And I had to cancel it in order to do that. And then be able to reschedule. I cancel it. It's no more shifts available. So I can't reschedule it. But I was like, I'm still going to go because I was still on the roster. I'm pretty sure because I was already set for it. So, yeah. I'm tired. And y'all. I have very good health. I'm a very active person, but I think I'm just tired because that really just blew me. Like it really just blew me. I'm gonna show y'all the parking lot whenever I come back out. Y'all, tell me why I got forgot where I parked. For some reason, I was thinking I was on that line. Literally lost the car. And my battery is low on my keys. So, um, I was pressing my unlock button and it wasn't beeping. But then I started pressing my 
lock button and it started going off and I found it. So I almost, oh. y'all see I'm about sweating. This little sweat on my face just broke out from whenever I stepped outside. So y'all, I almost would've had to walk around this little section, but it's whole little section, big section, but on this side, not the whole parking lot, parking lot, like the whole thing that y'all saw me filming. And keep in mind, I didn't get. So y'all, in this clip, I'm just showing you all a view of the parking lot from where I was. Think of it being about the size of two to three car lots combined. Um, I was only on one side of it. Um, this is not including the other side as well as the front side of it. So it's really, really huge. Also, please don't mind the crack on my windshield. A little pellet hit it when I was on the highway and it expanded over the course of time. So I know to let my windows down. I've been doing that. If it bothers you, I'm sorry, honey. Cash at me so I can get it fixed. But let's continue with the video because I dropped some more knowledge. Okay, y'all, so I was supposed to close this video out last week and tell you all overall the process of me applying to Amazon and the on-hire interview, how that went, and how I got the job overall in general, and I never got a chance to film it, so if you all want that video, comment down below and let me know. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to become a part of the Trap House, and yeah, if y'all want that video, just let me know. I'm not going to film it if if ain't nobody gonna say they want it so let me know you want it um just enjoy this these clips of me being my crazy tail self and yeah thank you for watching hey guys it's dosage big motherfucking dosage period you already fucking know it's your girl tila it's dosage big motherfucking dosage welcome to the motherfucking trap house bitch the fuck girl stop what do you people think of her but it just coming up. Y'all think I'm crazy. Let me stop. Oh, guys, that's right. It's 11 11. Period. Make sure you bitches tell King Lou thank you. Tell him thank you. Tell Dosis thank you. Because I just blessed you with the angel number. Period. Can I just catch you having fun?